Hey, what up, what up, what up? Um, it's your boy Usher, AK Big Easy, AK Big Cheeks. I <laughs> uh, wanted to do an updated 2024 um, controller video. People have been asking about it for like 5M and stuff like that. Also, really any other game, but like just to kind of give you an example of how we're going to do this. So, I switched to DS4 Windows about two months ago. Should have done it years ago or however long it's been out because it is perfect. One big thing about DS4 Windows as well is that you are able to literally unplug and plug your controller in while you're in 5M and, and stuff like that and then like not to restart your game. Like it's it's pretty helpful. Um, and it doesn't affect any other game on Steam or anything like that or anything that you use. You can just turn DS4 Windows off for any other game and have it on just for certain games you actually use it for for certain keybinds. You can also have different um, profiles for different games and stuff, and so it it's definitely super, super helpful. I'll put the link in DS4 Windows um, in the video or description, whatever. You know you know how it goes. Um, and you guys can take a look at that. Super easy to download, super easy to use. Just download it, install it. That's it. There's no weird steps, nothing weird. Promise. Obviously, you're going to download it, open the file, do the exe file, install it. Like, if you can't go past that, like, I don't know what to tell you. Like, I'm, you know what I mean? <laughs> All right. But it's gonna pop on your screen when you um, get it open and everything. That's what it's gonna look like. Um, for you, it's gonna already automatically start, but like I had to minimize and it stops when I do that. It's gonna pull up the controller that you have plugged in. You can do the Bluetooth stuff if you want. Um, just plug it in. Just plug it in. You can try and do the Bluetooth stuff where you like go on your Windows and you um, Bluetooth it. If it's an Xbox controller, I'm sure you can Bluetooth it just fine. Um, so keep doing whatever you're doing, how you connect it. But honestly, if it's if it's a PlayStation controller, just plug it in. That's, I'm just gonna be straight up with you. Just just plug the damn thing in. Um, all right. So to set up these keybinds for like push to talk in game and like radio and stuff like that, which is obviously I'm gonna suggest using those things. You can have your radio and your like your team speak and stuff like that, or like your in game. Well, however you do your radio, I don't, I don't know how you do it, but for your server, whatever it is. And then your push talking game all on the controller at once so that you're not if you're a controller player You're not having to take off your fingers for the keyboard for any talking at all Like that's the biggest thing here. Okay, like you should have been doing this a long ass time ago I've been playing 5m if you've never done this as 5m and you've had to take your finger off the controller To like talk to people in like a 1080 or something like that or like bro. What, what have you been doing? <laughs> like, like that's crazy to me. Okay So you're gonna go to edit on the controller and then you're just gonna go to controls. So for me always use the option button it's not going to affect your in-game pause menu and shit like that because literally ds4 windows is making your controller turn any other keybind off period okay so i'll use that options button for my in-game push talk obviously like n is the main thing for gta 5 right so you're just going to click on that it's going to pull up this screen and then you're going to just click on n and like like that's it you know what I mean? If, like, whatever key you want that you have in game for your keybind for push talk, I have N because, like, that's the default one. And dev developers, like, don't ever use N for anything because they know that servers use N for push talk for in game. So just do that. So exit out. Good to go. And then for your radio, I go to the right um, stick because yes that's my look behind whatever okay i get it like click c on your keyboard if you really like if it's that big of a deal to you i haven't used look behind on my controller for over a year so like i'm used to it i get that could be a big deal for somebody but use the you see on your keyboard for a second you need to look behind you okay it's gonna bring it up do caps lock that's what i use for our in-game radio also that's our radio key for like team speak for sonoran radio and like team speak and stuff change it to caps lock um, that's the caps, caps lock keybind in 5M. Obviously, make sure your 5M keybinds are like what this says as well. So that we're all, like, everything's connected. So, like, whatever you have your keyboard as needs to be your keybind in 5M for that as well. So they're all the same. Like, the pause menu thing, I was just saying that because we just need to go ahead and, like, don't worry about it. It's not a big deal. DS4 Windows turns off the pause menu, so don't worry about the options button. Okay? What I'm saying is make sure that you have your keybinds the same like caps lock needs to be your caps lock radio game in talk on 5m as well okay simple boom so that's connected um then obviously you're going to click save 
that is now going to have your options button as your push to talk for in game for regular talk and then your caps lock will be your radio game for in talk for game that's it that's it if you don't restart your computer this is always going to be on whenever you restart like whenever you start, so exit out yes disconnect all controllers i have it on my taskbar that's it it's already plugged in and it automatically turns on when you're in 5m like what is it fucking 12 in the afternoon let me let me show you real quick like literally i'll unplug my controller i'm just gonna show you guys this real quick so you can see You guys are having a good Christmas, by the way. Coming up, getting hot, getting quick, getting crazy. By the way, your boy's losing a, losing some pounds. That's all I'm gonna say. That's why that face cam came on, cause when we when we come around, y'all y'all gonna be like, what the fuck? Actually, what's going on, brother? You like, oh, the bacon's gone, kid. Yeah, I know. Ha <laughs> ha. That's why my knee. Monk, 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 monk. I'm not trying to make this video too long. I'll be quick for you guys. I'm not editing it either, so. Alright. Give me the sign so you guys can see that I'm, like, turning it off. Alright. Okay. <clears throat> All right, so get that shit back over here. It's right here. Boom. Okay. Oh my, it's gonna tab out. I know it's gonna. Listen, everyone, calm down. All right. Obviously, I'm running around. I'm able to run around. Da da da. Okay. Here's my thing. I'm gonna stop it. Okay. Right. You can hear me move my shit. I can't do anything. I'm only pressing all my shit, okay? Can't fucking move, right? While I'm still in game, bruh. This is the biggest thing for me. This is the biggest thing for me. Boom. On, right? Bro. I can fucking just plug that shit big and it works. For me, if I was using, like, Steam or, like, Big Picture Mode or whatever or not using this, I couldn't just put my controller back and I had to restart my game. Like... I know if you have Xbox, it might not matter, but like for me, I had to understand. I guess that's just key. Anyways, that's gonna be it. Appreciate y'all. Have a wonderful fucking day. Swipe money. Jesus loves you.